when I was in that room and I was serving, the Lord gave me a vision. And in my vision, I saw a number of high school students. They were walking around their high school just like normal. They looked handsome, they looked beautiful. They looked like everything was on the outside was just fine. But yet, they all were walking around the halls like this. They had chains attached to their ankles. They had chains and weights attached to their legs. No one could see them. They were easy to hide on the outside, but on the inside they were dealing with issues. They were dealing with weights. They had problems going on that nobody knew about. They had baggage that they were carrying from their past. And I could see it so vividly and I just remember being so taken aback by what I was seeing, by this vision of all of these young people walking down the hall around their lockers with chains, just like this. And I believe that there are some young women in this room that came into this place like this, carrying chains from their past, carrying weights, carrying baggage from things that went wrong in their past, carrying so many different things, but I want you to know that tonight is gonna to break off of you. Jesus Christ came to break every chain off of your life. That is why Jesus came. He came to set you free. He came to bring you into relationship with God. I have my own testimony. I've experienced things. You see these pictures. I did some modeling in college and I know what it's like to deal with chains. I know what it's like to have on makeup and to look good on the outside and to be dealing with a bad relationship and to be dealing with sickness and to be dealing with negative thoughts about yourself. I know what that's like. I'm not talking about something that I have not experienced. And so when I tell you Jesus loves you and when I tell you that he wants you to be free, I know that because he has done that for and because I have been set free, I have come to proclaim the gospel to you, to let you know that you can be free and that you are loved and that you are cherished, that you are planned, that you have a purpose in your life and that you don't have to be dealing with these chains, but that you can be free to be everything that God has called you to be. As you take it, you cry out to God and you toss that chain and you say, you know what? I'm not going to walk around with all this mess and this baggage anymore. I don't care. The devil is a lie. I have some soldier women in this room. I have some strong women of God in this room that are not going to have it anymore. You're going to say, you know what? I'm letting it go. I'm letting it go. I'm not going to carry it. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not going to people please. I'm not going to do what everybody wants. I'm going to do what God wants me to do and I'm gonna hold on to my freedom. Where are my free girls at? Where are my free girls at? Where are my free girls?